So right behind me here, we're unveiling our newest autonomous camera system. So you guys may have been here before we had the camera system that kind of sat on the front. We moved everything integrated into the roof line of that cab. So 16 cameras giving 360 degrees of view at all times. And that enables an autonomous tillage solution. The ability to take this tractor to the farm, uh, load up your guidance lines in your map, and then leave, start that tractor, and come back to a fully tilled field. So today, just tillage, that's what we're focusing on, uh, but spread across a lot of different tillage tools. So every customer has some different tillage practices. We're able to use high-speed disc, vertical tillage, uh, some chisel plows, and we continue to add more. The great news is the technology that we're showing here with these cameras, uh, we're hoping to be able to use across multiple different production systems you know, as we advance in the autonomy journey. This is a normal ADAR tractor right off the line today that we've added these camera systems on. If they want to hop in and they want to run tillage, they want to go plant, run a grain cart, that's great. And then they decide that they're done for the day and they want this tractor to go ahead and till that next field while they sleep. They're able to go ahead, start the machine without any physical changes to the machine, get out and using their operation center app on their phone, enable the autonomous tillage. The main thing to know about the system is those cameras aren't really doing anything other than visual like you and I would do in the cab. So the rest of how the tractor performs is all done with our G5 Advance that we've had for many years. So a lot of our customers are using AutoPath, Auto Track Turn Automation, all those things today, and they trust that. All we're doing is adding the camera system to replace you and me. The thing is with you and I is we have maybe 180 degrees of view uh, one time. This has 360 degrees all the time without exception. No blinking, no turning, no closing its eyes, right? So it's arguably gonna see more and see that obstacle that maybe you haven't seen, well before you would. So the system is built on our true set tillage technology that we've had. So uh, the tillage tool, we have the ability to remotely raise, lower, set basket pressures and discs, tillage depth and all that. So a customer would plan, get to the field, set up that tillage tool the way they like, and then go ahead and, and turn it on. The nice thing is after that, once that tillage tool has been set, it'll manage itself via what are called true set active. So, Let's say they get into a really muddy condition and mud's building up on the tires. The tool knows that mud's getting built up and the tool's raising, it'll automatically lower itself down. The great part is, at any time, you can remote into this machine, look at any of those cameras, see the tillage job it's doing, and make adjustments remotely from your phone while sitting at home, at the office, or from the combine. I think right now there's a lot of things going on, whether it be labor, whether it be mother nature, and just overall trying to get more done with less time and, and, and maybe even labor. So what this really enables these customers to do is flexibility. Uh, when, this, when spring and mother nature is pushing and they're on the, t on the clock, they can have this machine running autonomously for tillage while they're running the planting tractor, right? Or maybe they do have some labor during the day. They're able to run normally like you or I would, and then at night go ahead and run autonomously so they wake up to a tilled field to go ahead and run the planter. And then in the fall, you got a lot of people, you know, maybe running grain car tractors and trucks, moving grain. This thing could be following up that combine, doing tillage right behind the combine. So it really is a, it's a force multiplier. Uh, you know, customers are looking at it a lot of different ways, maybe having one person run two or three of them, or just having one of them that they can use when needed. And that's the great part about it, is it's a normal tractor till you want it to be autonomous. So we have a demo fleet that's out, in the mid, uh, out throughout the U.S. this year. They'll be doing lots of demos. We've had some demo opportunities last fall as well, and we're continuing to build that out. So if a customer is really interested, you know, we'll have lots of these running with dealers throughout the United States this year. You know, right behind me, we have a new tractor, but this isn't just for new tractors. This is retrofittable back to 2020 and newer eights, 22 and newer nines, and for tillage tools as old as t model year 2017. So if a customer doesn't, it's not in the budget, maybe to update tractors this year, the technology retrofitting back to their older tractor would be a great use uh, and something they could look at doing if they're not quite ready to make a jump to maybe the newest tractor we have. In general, it's everyone's facing pressure from the, the economy, time, and mother nature. Uh, you know, I'd say in general, uh, farmers that have low amounts of labor and lots of work are the ones that are looking at it. I'd say the customers that maybe have lots of labor um, maybe aren't as interested, but I'd say in general, there's not a lot of customers out there that have tons of labor will, you know, willing to run when they need to run. So I wouldn't say there's a specific demographic, and the great part is um, if they have labor, they don't have to run autonomously. And then when maybe they are lacking at those certain busy times, they can run autonomously. So with these kits that we're kind of launching here today throughout the rest of this year, um, those are 
we have customers, machines that are model year 20 getting installed as we speak with this camera system. The best place to start is your local John Deere dealer. And then we also have lots of information that launched with Commodity Classic on Deere.com.